there was a ruling, uh, Mr. Shaw, I believe there was a ruling with the banks this week and the feds having to do with modifications and having to do with the settlement. I think they made a promise and a commitment of a certain amount of money um, attributed to that modification. But if there's more information around that settlement, it would be great to provide that to the board and the commission. Right. The, the numbers I've seen, which are very preliminary at this point, are, I believe, I want to say the articles I've seen have been around $1.2 billion, but I think it's preliminary. I can report back to the board uh, next month, but the, the information I have is very preliminary. It would be wonderful if we could see how much of that mod money was attributed to San Francisco for modifications. I'll see whether or not that information is available. Thank you. Yeah, first, I want to make a few points. I actually wanted to um, address the topic that uh, Ross Rhodes mentioned, mm -hmm. saying you may not be touched by what the banks have done. Everyone in this room, pretty much everyone from the next generation will mm -hmm. be touched. Mm -hmm. Because uh, for us as savers, we're earning virtually zero from the banks. Mm -hmm. So I want to make it clear that I can empathize with you and that everyone is touched, and probably be touched for a generation or so as because of this. The advice I would give to you is to broaden. It's not just Wells Fargo Bank. I mean, obviously there's a lot of other banks that are involved in this. And what I would seek out would be predatory practices, number one. Number two, the illegal methods, number two. Because that is something we can deal with, okay? You know, you mentioned divestment. We've got level one, level two, level three. I would characterize level one divestment as Houston, we have a problem. And we do. So that's the way I would focus on level one, which is to bring attention to the companies that this behavior, particularly the illegal uh, activities, are reprehensible, change your actions. That's level one. Level two depends on the response, and level three is the final for divestment. So what I would suggest to you is to ad address that route. Number two, there's a shareholders meeting at Wells Fargo. Um, buy a share of stock and present a resolution. You know, present something. Um, that's, those are your venues to do, to do that. But that's what I would suggest to you. I can empathize with you. I think this is far-reaching. And no one has gone to jail over the panic of 2008 and uh, everything else. So oh. I wanna, as I said, I think there are culprits. Everyone is paying the price for this. Yeah. Yep. So anyway, I have to Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And we will continue to do our job to try to preserve your pension plans. Yes. Thank you.